All right, everybody, we are back for game three with our Crypto Token. We've made a few minor changes to our land base. If you've been watching, um, I stuck in the Westvale Abbeys and, and stuck in some uh, dual lands that I probably should have already done before. Uh, let's see, we will, we've got three, uh, we can cast the Trinketeer, so I, I think we're going to keep it. Um, I'm hoping we'll draw into some green, which we'll need at some point. So, all right, they lead off with the planes, and let's see what else they've got going on. Uh, Thraben Inspector. And that'll probably be it for them. Okay, so it's our turn, and oh, this thing clicks through my turn uh, unintentionally. Most of it, at least, we got to make our land drop. So we will have a servo exhibi exhibition next turn, and they're green and white, so hinterland logger, so we got a, a werewolf. That will become a 4-2. They're getting in for one with the inspector. Challenging sometime. We're playing Dan 750. Um, I know I have had a lot of lag issues lately. I don't know if that's what's going on there, or sometimes we just get uh, some players on MTGO. It, it is confusing what's going on. So uh, with with the interface, as we know. Oh, a second Nissa. Really not what I was hoping to get. Um, so I'm still just kind of stuck here. Uh, until I can get a green, and then we can start getting the uh, the land we need. I should have cast my exhibition, but I did not, so that allowed them to transform. So that is a mistake on my part, and I should have caught that. But I did not, so we will just have to deal with it. So let him get going, and... We'll uh, see pretty sh pretty quickly. Okay, so he makes an 8-6 shredder. So he's coming in for 9. So he's done 10 points in 3 turns. So I've got to get some... There's uh, green for us. All right, so that will at least pull our next green that we need. Give us another forest. Um, and then allow us to play Servo Exhibition this turn at least to make some trump, or some trump, some uh, chump blockers, except this uh, werewolf here has trample, so that was a big mistake by me allowing that to transform. Well, but actually I got him to transform back, so that's good. He's still got me at... Uh, over a bad spot. It'd be great if I could draw the authority of the consoles next and then uh, drop that and Nissa and put a plant token into play and that would start to buy me a little bit of time. Um, so he's coming in again with a trampler. I, I'm really just not going to do me any good to block. So we're at three now. Well, may not do us much good, but we're going to try with Nissa and to go ahead and plus her up. Make a plant. Maybe that'll give us a little bit of time. I doubt it. If I can get to next turn, I'm not going to have a real answer for trample damage at this point. 
the trinketeer will help. So if I can drop the trinketeer and then drop a counter on everybody, then that'll give me a little bit of stability, I hope. And uh, then the next turn, I can drop another counter and drop a new Nissa onto the board. And hopefully I'll have big enough creatures. He's only got three cards in his hand, so we are not dead yet. But the longer that I don't get something out, he's coming straight at me for three. So he did not bite and go after Nyssa. So I will block here and I will take one. Let's see if he's got a combat trick to make it up to three damage. Looks like he does. Okay, well, just to save that guy. Okay, well, that prevents him from transforming again. Takes me down to two. All right, well, there's my Angel of Invention. This could uh, make a big difference for us here. So we're going to drop the Angel with her servos. servos. We're going to put counters on everybody. So that makes our guys bigger. And we're going to just swing in for five just to put a little bit of pressure back. Next turn we can drop the Trinketeer and the get rid of this Nyssa and put in a new Nyssa into play. And actually we could end up having five five servos next turn, which might be able to allow us to just end the game depending on what he plays. Desperate Sentry, so that's nice. Okay, so now I think what we're going to do is put our Trinketeer into place, put him on the battlefield, and we'll go ahead and get rid of this Nyssa, bumping everybody up. Put in another Nyssa. We'll go ahead and let her put a counter on everybody also. And that's going to give us a bunch of big creatures. And I think we can probably just... Um, see, that's 18. Yeah, I think we can probably just go ahead and um, attack with everybody who can attack. And that's probably going to be the game pretty soon for us. That ought to put us in a good spot there. He's got, what's that, 6, 18, 22 plus 5, 27 points coming. 7 of it he can't block, and that will gain us seven, 5 life, um, or 5. Yeah, okay, so all right, draw a card. There we go. All right, so uh, I think we're going to just run this back in. So we were able to hold on there. Didn't look good, but we were able to. Terrible, terrible land drops. And then we go to another from one land to no lands with our six. 
and then to one land with our five. Oh, that's so terrible. Uh, I'm going to keep this one because I really don't have a choice. We're going to have to put Nyssa on the bottom. we got to get a land. So fortunately, well, there's no fortune. And, oh, I've got all three big. Oh, this is terrible. Terrible, terrible. So a cryptolith lot, right? Jeez. Uh, if I can draw a land and then a servo exhibition, then I can at least start making some progress. But with a, barring that, it's just going. I'm, we're probably just going to get run over here because this is just terrible. Well, we can put a creature down, but this doesn't help us until we get some land. Fortunately, now we just need a land and a servo exhibition, and then we should be able to start casting everything else if we don't lose all of our creatures. Driving Rhino. And here we go. We should have two coming in. Yep, we can't do anything about it. Maybe we can draw a land. No, we get another eight mana casting cost creature. So all of the casting cost creature, all of our creatures that are big, we got. Lovely. Now we'll have an even bigger Rhino coming, so we should have 5 damage coming, take us to 13. So there's nothing really we can do. Well, there's a land, so at least now I can play Cryptolith right, and we'll see if that helps. If I can survive a turn... Can I, I could make a chump blocker. Thirteen. Well, a big trampler isn't going to help our cause. Two big tramplers isn't going to help our cause there, so. Fourteen. Fifteen, I think we're just going to... Um, we're just going to concede this game and go on to the next, which we're just going to submit this back and hope that we can get some land this time. It's amazing to me how often you you don't just get one bad draw, but your mulligans are terrible too. So that's almost why I never want to even mulligan with this System. See, I hate this. I'm going to keep it just because I've got four lands. But, and there's only one decimator of provinces in this deck. But I'm seeing them all the time. So, it's, it's very odd to me. So, We'll drop our planes, we'll pass the turn. Forest and nothing. Okay, so that's that's actually pretty good for us. This is turning out okay. What would have been better is to have a servo expedition in hand and cast that this turn, drop the cryptolith right, and then have those the third land drop and two tokens that we could then play the glint sleeve artisan. That would have taken us out a little bit faster. Um, this is reveal, so I can reveal that, and I'll drop my glint sleeve artisan, and we're going to make a servo that gives us ramp, so we can cast a six casting cost next turn. Another hinterland logger. All right, well, now um, we're getting all the lands. So that's better than not getting any. So we are at 10 here. So that would be 9, 8, 7, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 
I could actually cast the Decimator of Provinces. I think I could emerge him, right? Um, let's see if we can do that. Now let's try it. There we go. We don't get the ability to do much good this turn, but we got him out early, so we've got a 7-7. Trample haste uh, on the board on turn four. That's pretty good. I'd say that that's okay. Um, that's going to start hitting in and putting him on... Uh, a pretty steep clock. So let's go to combat. So normally the decimator gives us our uh, wide board alpha strike, but here it may just be enough to be um, early pressure while we try to draw into something else and maybe get some decent damage in. So seven points of damage, a 7-7 seven, seven, uh, trampler with haste is certainly, certainly not bad to be able to get out on turn four. Not to mention if I had other creatures it would have... Uh, would have been thrown in some more damage, but. Okay, here's the Renegade Freighter. So it's a 4-3. And I don't think he's going to have an answer for us. Let's drop Thalia. So everything he does comes into play tapped as non-basic lands and creatures. And then we will attack with our big pig again. And so I suppose he's hoping he can simply um, draw something next turn to crew that freighter and let him get enough power to come in and kill everything, but I don't think he's going to. There we go. So, all right, there we go. Hope you enjoyed the game, and um, we will uh, talk a little bit more about it. I'll give you a quick view of the deck. I'll try to get a, a deck list up if anybody's, uh, if anybody's wanting to look at it. Um, there, we've got Decimator of the Provinces, It of the Horrid Swarm, Anuvenwald Hydra, and uh, three Angel of Inventions, two Nissas, Voice of Zendikar, two Collective Effort. This has been very helpful. Two Thalias, uh, four Trinketeers, four Artisans, two or one Borrowed Grace, three Cryptolith Rite, uh, four Servo Exhibition, Exhibition, two Traverse, the Elvenwad, three uh, Ovia. For, or one Oath of Nyssa, three Authority of the Councils. I put in the Westvale Abbeys, two of those, and then I put in two Canopy Vistas and two Fortified uh, Village, and then we've got a bunch of lands. So 23 lands, 19 creatures, um, but our other, or we've got four Servo Exhibitions, which really are a couple of creature bringers. So anyway, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, subscribe, like, all of that stuff. And uh, have a great day. Keep brewing.